Welcome to Intelligent Leads on the Insight Platform. In this series of videos, my goal is to show you everything you need to know to get started on Intelligent Leads. First, let's take a look at your dashboard, which is the first page displayed when you log into the product. In the top left corner is a snapshot or a summary of your subscription. Starting from the top, you'll see all new projects since you last logged in, all updated projects since you last logged in, all the projects within the database that you're subscribed to, and all the companies within the database that you're subscribed to. Note that all these numbers are hyperlinks, so you can click on any of the numbers and drill into the set of project or company results. To the right of the summary of the snapshot is a density or a heat map, which will display the search results for any of the saved searches that you have set up. Below that, you'll see a search bar. There are several different ways to search for targeted project or company results within Intelligent Leads, and we'll show you how to run searches in another video. Finally, at the bottom of the screen is a dark gray box, which will display all the results for any saved searches you have set up. So again, you'll see all new or updated projects since you last logged in, all the projects since you last logged in, and then we also run a cross search to pull back all the project participants that match your saved searches. So just to recap what we've seen here today, on the dashboard, you'll see a snapshot or a summary of your subscription in the top left-hand corner. You'll see a heat or a density map, which will display the search results for all of your saved searches. You'll have a search bar where you can run several different types of project, company, or document searches. And at the bottom is the uh, box which will display all the project and company results for any of the saved searches that you have set up. So I hope you found this video helpful. To learn more, please check out the other videos in our series. And as always, if you have any questions about the product, you can contact your account manager or the Read customer support team anytime.